everyone, Josh here, and I'm getting ready to do the six best Marriott's in Dubai in just eight quick nights. These are the most luxurious properties in the whole city. Some even have views of the Burj Khalifa right behind me. We're here for New Year's, and I can't wait to show you the city, the hotels, and which hotel with Marriott would be the best choice if you're planning a trip to come to this most amazing city in the whole world. Hi everyone, we are here at the La Meridian Resort and Spa. There are actually a few La Meridians in Dubai, uh, but this one from the pictures looked like the absolute best one. Uh, so we are here just for one quick night. The lobby, absolutely incredible. Very big, spacious, light. Very inviting. Absolutely amazing. Okay, we just checked in. Now here's our room at the La Meridian Resort and Spa in Dubai. We're room 412. We have the two beds and we do have a sea view. Come on. Let's go ahead and start with the bathroom. Uh, so real quick, uh, the bathroom is a little smaller than the other luxury hotels we've been on on this trip, but it's still very nice, very light, very open area. We got a nice big countertop, just one sink here. Uh, we have a big mirror. We have like a tub with a like glass thingy. Um, I'm not quite sure what this is for. I think it's to keep the water from like splashing out. Um, but also we do have another rainfall shower. This is the fourth hotel. All of them have had that nice rainfall shower. Um, very cool. We also have a separate toilet over here. And that's that. I mean, yeah, a little bit smaller bathroom, but it's still very, very nice. So let's go take a look at the beds now. We also have a lot of really nice storage cabinets over here. We've got one, two, also got a robe hanging up in that one. Uh, we have another little, uh, we got the safe up there. Down here we've got the mini fridge. Looks like we have a tea maker, uh, some other amenities. Now here's the room. Got the two beds, really nice, bright feel. I love that kind of backdrop. We've got this really cool hangy light thingy. Uh, we got the little reading lights above the beds. Very nice. Uh, got some USB ports over here. Looks good. Carpeted floors. Got a nice work desk uh, with a huge TV. A lot of nice parts here as well to charge phones, things like that. Got another cool little light here that we can turn on. Two little seating areas over here. They actually left us some little amenity of a fruit in the room. It's a really nice touch. The other really great thing is every room here, I believe has a balcony and we have one of the best views in the house being that sea view. So let's go ahead and take a look outside on our beautiful little balcony. So here's the balcony. This hotel has three different pools. We haven't yet experienced them, but we're excited to. Way out there, I don't know if you can see it, but we've got Atlantis in the distance. Uh, that's at the end of the palm. So that's over there. We can only see part of the palm, uh, but we'll be at the St. Regis and the W over there for the next two nights. This is hotel number four out of six of the most luxurious Marriott's in Dubai. So excited to show you the rest of the hotel. Uh, we just went to the lounge, uh, very, very nice. Uh, they have that available to Platinum Lead and Higher members, complimentary drink. Uh, in the evening, we went up there for the tea time, which goes until 4.30. They had beautiful little sandwiches they brought us, and anything we wanted to order on the drink menu from coffee to tea. Really, really nice. I've actually never had that before when we like, got a whole lunch worth of sandwiches um, included. Um, in addition, in the morning with the titanium status, we get breakfast in the restaurant, uh, which is just right on over there. Uh, that will be in the morning. The restaurant looks absolutely huge. Um, so far, I am so impressed. This is like an extremely luxurious hotel for being a La Meridian. It's my first time staying at a La Meridian, um, but I can definitely see why this place has received such high scores. Almost every review I've seen on TripAdvisor and on the Marriott website gives this place all five stars, and I see why. Um, even the service, we actually had, uh, they opened our doors when we came in, they took our luggage out, took, delivered it to our room, and then they actually walked us to our room, two gentlemen did, showed us our room, welcomed us in. I am absolutely blown away by this La Meridian experience. Let's go over here real quick, because I really want to show you the other part of the lobby. Uh, check in over here. As you can see, this is how spacious as it is. And then we'll, we'll go ahead and we'll hang around this way. Here's the other side of the lobby. The La Meridian Beach Resort and Spa is situated on Jumara Beach overlooking the Arabian Gulf and consisting of 19 acres of landscaped gardens. It has 508 rooms and suites with many of them having views of the sea or the Dubai Marina. 
They also have three temperature controlled pools and a health club retreat, which is available to guests 16 years and older, which is like the spa. They also have a state of the art fitness center, which is very spacious and roomy with every equipment you could ask or want. Now they also have about 13 restaurants and bars on property. This one of course was breakfast, which was our favorite. Now they also have this uh, kind of club latitude bar that is available for platinum elites and higher. It is excellent because they actually give you complimentary snacks in the evening as well as drinks. Okay, now for the review of the La Meridian Resort and Spa here in Dubai. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and start with the room. Uh, I'm gonna give the room a 4.5 out of five. While everything was very clean and nice, the one drawback was the shower. It was a little uncomfortable. It was really odd. You had to like stand up and get into a tub. There's this weird door. There was nothing luxurious about the shower. Otherwise, everything was very clean and nice. Uh, next up, we want to talk about inspiration. I'm going to give this hotel a four out of five. It wasn't anything that completely blew my mind while it was really nice. Uh, next up is going to be service. Definitely five out of five. Everyone is really friendly. And then finally, value when I come back. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give that a four out of five as well. While it was very nice and I might come back, it's not like perfect on my list uh, to be back to. But overall, really, really wonderful hotel. Really wonderful, I think mostly for like families traveling together as you have all the three different pools to utilize. You have the most amazing breakfast um, I've ever had. Um, you also have a spa, fitness center, a lot of amenities on property, um, as well as uh, currently they have a shuttle to the expo. I'm sure when the expo is over, that shuttle might go somewhere else, um, but they have a lot of nice uh, concierge services as well. Well, they'll be able to help you plan your trip, book tickets. Really, really, really nice.